Welcome back to another DIY. As you can see here, I have some vases that I cleaned out and they're just sitting here drying. Here is what you will need for the next DIY. Some scissors, diamond wrap, E6000, hot glue, and glue sticks. You will also need a foam ball and some acrylic gemstones. You will need some gemstones, vases, flowers, diamond wrap, and candle holders, tea light candle holders. As you can see on here, I took the mirrors and I wrapped the mirrors and the diamond wrap around the vase. And I put the tea light candle holder on top of it. This is just a close up picture of the tea light candle holders that I had glued on top of the vases. Now you can see on here that I glued the two vases together on top of each other. Here's where I put the acrylic gemstones in the vase and used them as a filler. I filled it to the top. Here's where I topped it off with a flower foam ball and two tea light candle holders on the side that are lit up with lights. This was just another centerpiece that I had made with the flower foam ball that's sitting on top of a mirrored riser with flowers and gemstones. This is just another look where I had took the flower foam ball off top so you can see it with or without the flower foam ball on top of it. This is also another look here where I just put a white light inside of the vase, but it's the same vases with a different kind of light inside. This is what you will need for the next DIY. Flowers, tea light candle holders, vases, gemstones, and mirror stickers. This is what the outcome looks like. I glued the mirrors around the vase, put the gemstones inside, and put the flowers in the inside of it. This is the same vase where I just put the pearl strands in the inside of it and also topped it with some roses. On this one here is where I added water and topped it with some roses on the top and bottom. See it here is cut up some plates that I had got from Party City that I didn't show with a mirror, some popsicle sticks and scissors. And also your glue stick, glue gun, and a piece of cardboard. Here is where I was doing a dry run to see if this is how I wanted to put this together. As you can see, the plates were I cut around the rim. Well, I didn't use the plate rim part of the plate. I just used a cardboard where I started gluing them around. On this part here, I turned it over and put the popsicle sticks on the back on every one of them. I don't show the little ones, but I also put them on the little ones too. This was the final piece where I put the gemstones around the mirror and put the gemstones on the long pieces. It came out pretty. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit the thumbs up button.